It's time to really get back into the swing of things for thousands of families today. More North Texas students and teachers getting ready for the first day of class. Yeah, here we go. Cedar Hill, Everman, Garland and Rockwall are just a few of the districts who are heading back. And some of you may notice extra security protocols that are in place this morning. Right. Our Chris Sadegi is live in Dallas with more. And Chris, leaders there, uh, they're starting with backpacks. Yes, Cleo, no matter where I go, I make sure that I bring my clear see-through purse with me. No, not really. That was just a giveaway item I have. But when kids start showing up to Pershing Elementary or any Dallas ISD campus, they will be wearing clear see-through backpacks. That is because the DISD once again requiring students to have a backpack that's either clear or mesh. This started a couple years ago for grades 6 through 12, but was expanded to include all grades last year. The good news for parents is the district is providing each student with a clear backpack free of charge. The kids are allowed a pouch inside the clear backpack where they can keep their personal items. Now, coming up in 30 minutes, we're going to chat with the principal here at Pershing Elementary, talk about the clear backpacks and other things they're doing to make sure kids are kept safe during the school day. Now, if you're going to start the school year off, might as well do it with a good weather day. For that, I'm going to send it all the way out to Irving, where we find Marielle Ruiz with our school day forecast. Good morning, Marielle. Good morning, Chris. I really loved that clear bag. By the way, I may have to borrow it for some upcoming Friday night football games. Just saying. So I'm hanging out with the band here at Irving High School this morning. They're behind me. They've been busy with two a days for the past couple of weeks. Uh, and I mean, no surprise, it's been hot, right? And today it's going to be hot as well. Let's go ahead and get to your back to school forecast on the way to school. I can tell you here on uh, right here, we are actually experiencing a really nice breeze. Temperatures are going to be in the low 80s. It's going to be warm, sunny. It is going to be a little humid, but you can expect that for August, right? And as we head towards the middle part of the day, it's going, those temperatures are just going to be climbing at 94 degrees for recess or around noontime. So definitely make sure that the kids are hydrating all day long. And then after school, a lot of locations experiencing triple digits and you've heard Greg mention it not just today but several days this week so definitely make sure to plan on that for any after school activities like I know these kids here at band are going to do. So we're going to talk a little bit more about back to school obviously here in the next hour or so. Cleo I'm going to send it back over to you. All right.